Hi all and welcome back to the channel. Um, your support has just blown me away. I know I, I say this every time I make a video, but I, just, I wouldn't be doing it if it wasn't for you guys actually showing an interest in what I'm doing. And, and I, I, I appreciate it. I really do. Thank you so much for the subs and the likes. It's just, it's just blown me away. It started off as something that I wanted to do just to alleviate the boredom. Um, but I, I kind of feel like I'm making these for you now rather than me, which is nice. I like that. Today, I'm going to make a video about how to join a Wi-Fi network. I was asked this in, um, in one of the comments from one of the other videos, and I thought, yeah, sounds like a good one. Um, somebody wants to know. Let's, let's do that. Um, guys, by all means, you know, put suggestions on what you would like me to do. I'm, I'm happy to take suggestions. You know, these videos are just as much for you as they are for me, like I said. So, yeah, if you've got a suggestion on something that you want done, let me know and I'll, I'll try and make that for you. Yeah, so without further ado, let's, um, let's get on with it. So uh, I'm logged into my, uh, my FreeBSD uh, Mac Mini here. Um, and what you'll see is if we do the if config command, it will list our networks. So currently we, we've got our network um, interface um, listed as BGE0, which is the wired network, um, but we don't have a, a Wi-Fi card there. Uh, so if we do a, a quick D-message or this should show us that we have a Wi-Fi network card. There it is, BWN. It's the Broadcom BCM. Um, now, I don't expect you guys to have as much is issues as I did getting this to work. Um, it seems like Mac Minis aren't very well supported on this, which is, does not surprise me. Um, but there we go. So let's, uh, let's come out of there. So clean that up. And quite simply, it's just a couple of commands. So literally, so literally all we need to do is edit the etcrc.conf and add in these two. See these two here? The wireless LANs underscore BWN zero equals wireless LAN. And then if config underscore WLAN zero equals WPA DHCP. So what this is telling us is that we want to use the WPA key, and I'll show you how to configure that in just a sec. Um, and then we want it to get a DHCP address. Nice and easy. So the next thing we need to do is actually create the interface. So what we want to do is if config WLAN zero, create WLAN dev, and then BWN zero, BWN zero being substituted for your network card. And you'll find that in your D message. So there we go. So if I now look at my if config, I can now see my Wi-Fi. It's got its ether, which is its MAC address, but no carrier. So why haven't I got a carrier? Well, no carrier means it hasn't got an IP address and it's not connected. So we'll now connect that. So if you remember, I said to put in WPA DHCP. So there, we create a configuration file called WPA underscore supplicant.conf. Now you'll see <laughs> that it's got my Wi-Fi and password, but I'll blank these out so you can't see them. Um, so literally all you do to create that.
to create that, what we would do is WPA underscore pass phrase and the Wi Fi network. And then your Wi Fi key. And then we append it to ETC WPA supplicant. Here we go. Now, if we look at that, and that's what it produces. So once we've got that, we can then do the last command. and just restart our network. Give it a couple of seconds. And there we go. We will now see that we are connected to Wi-Fi. See the status associated. It really is that simple, thankfully. Um, most things on FreeBSD are pretty simple and easy to get around. Um, and then you can use that connection. So there you go. Hope you find this useful um, and helps you get your FreeBSD installation attached to your Wi-Fi. Um, I'll catch you in the next video. Hope you enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up and a like if you uh, if you enjoyed it. And please keep subscribing. It really does help me. Um, and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.